please intervene. And let's make sure that this madness stops. Councilman Kenneth Stokes ringing an alarm for Governor Tay Reeves to assess the garbage contract conflict in Jackson. This comes following the emergency contract with Richard's disposal, once again voted down by City Council. One major problem addressed, the placing of trucks on authorized airport property. Councilman Stokes also calling out an issue he calls environmental discrimination. By placing harmful truck smells and materials in poor neighborhoods. If you look, maybe 20 yards is homes, houses, people actually live in this neighborhood. Residents voicing their concerns about the company and the dumping that can potentially take place near Hawkins Field, where the trucks of Richard's disposal are stationed. When you have garbage trucks staging and have a garbage terminal right there, that's a dump. Now, Councilman Stokes says payment for Richard's disposal can be in jeopardy in the future, knowing the contract has been voted down several times. If it's not a contract with the city of Jackson, approved by the city council, then it's a great chance they won't get paid. So if they, Richards, do not, if Richards does not get paid, then how the employees going to get paid? With the garbage in Jackson piled up? And that's why we want the governor to get involved.